Hello guys, Devo for the day, it comes from Genesis chapter 29. Yes, I'm still in Genesis, I like Genesis a lot. Some good stuff in here. And so it says in verse 15, Then Laban said to Jacob, Because you are my kinsman, should you therefore serve me for nothing? Tell me, what shall your wages be? Now Laban had two daughters. The name of the elder was Leah, and the name of the younger was Rachel. Leah's eyes were lovely, and Rachel was graceful and beautiful. Jacob loved Rachel, so he said, I will serve you seven years for your younger daughter, Rachel. Laban said, It is better that I give her to you than that I should give her to any other man. Stay with me. So Jacob served seven years for Rachel, and they seemed to him but a few days because of the love he had for her. Now, this, this is kind of a really wonderful love story here. But what I want to what I want to talk about here is that Laban is Jacob's uncle, okay? Rachel is uh, Laban's daughter, right? And so is Leah. Uh, we see that Leah has lovely eyes, but what that really means is that she's probably ugly, is what we're hearing here. She doesn't look good. And then Rachel was was graceful and beautiful. And so Jacob was smitten by this lady. I mean, Rachel was the one he wanted. And so he was willing to work seven years. He's like, I'm going to work seven years so I can I can get this woman. I mean, and for him, those seven years were like nothing, nothing at all. It was, it's it's pretty it's pretty sappy stuff to tell you the truth. But uh, I guess that could happen. I guess that could happen. It's very romantic here. So it's one of those things where I, I have to smile and and when I see this. But what I want to what I want to get here to right here is about commitments, right? Notice that when that Jacob was able to keep his commitment to work for seven years. Now, why was he able to keep his commitment? Because there was a prize, there was a reward waiting for him that he thought was the most valuable thing so that this commitment that he made was like nothing, okay? The reward for, for making that seven-year commitment was like nothing nothing at all compared to the loveliness of Rachel right because compared to the beauty of Rachel compared to the grace of Rachel right she was well worth any work or effort that he had to put forth so he was able to keep that commitment because that reward was so valuable and a lot of times, right, God asks us to make commitments, right? As Christians, right, we are committed, right? We're committed to Christ, right? He is our Savior. He is our Master. He is our Lord, right? And we have to be committed to Him. Now, that commitment shouldn't be hard. It shouldn't be difficult, right? But a lot of times, it seems very difficult to be committed to Christ. And I think it's because we don't really have an idea of the reward, of how wonderful the reward for being a Christian is, right? And of course, the biggest reward is we can be with God forever in heaven. Now think about this. Heaven is this beautiful, wonderful, lovely place. It's great. It's a great place beyond anything that we could ever imagine or ever dream. Anything we could ever imagine or ever dream. More beautiful than Rachel right more wonderful than Rachel right and so that our commitment to Christ should be like nothing compared to the reward that we get to be able to go to heaven to be with Jesus and the Lord our father forever right that should be no it should be no effort but I think some a lot of times we get we, we, we forget what we're working towards what we're striving towards we can forget that I can forget that I know that I mean, it's easy it's easy to lose track of what's really important here uh, Jacob doesn't lose track of that he doesn't lose track of that he knows he knows that Rachel is well worth the seven years and you know what he didn't work just seven years for Rachel he worked 14 years for Rachel because his uncle Laban didn't give him Rachel after seven years. He gave him Leah. And so he had to work another seven years on top of the first seven, right? Really, to be able to have Rachel to be his own, okay? So that's a, one thing to think about, and that's the depot for the day.